我就口念嘅祝福文呢，就如果男性你哋望我听到，你就用我左耳听；包括 I V 念嘅英文呢，你都用左耳听。男士、女士呢，用右耳听。啊！祝愿世界和平、有识之士、善用科技知识、化解天灾人祸。祝愿所有祖国同胞们在有生之年有殊胜的机缘福气和能力去参与支援国家建设发展的事业，在生活上坚持科学兴家、迷信毁誉的理念，懂得与智者为伍，不会从本身与事没有前途的人口中去寻求前途指引，更不会被虚妄揣测的运程书所误导。阿威 ，May the world be blessed with peace and knowledgeable people use signs appropriately to avoid natural disasters and human damages. May all people of the global village be in their lives specially blessed with opportunities and ability to participate in supporting the building of their country, insisting on a concept of science-based development and rejecting damaging superstitious beliefs. May all of us acquaint ourselves with wise but seek no guidance and direction from people who are poorly designed for life or for misleading fortune-telling books. 祝愿所有人都明白到。他是不停地接受我哋资源援助才能生存，懂得行持感恩谦虚之爱心去帮助其他有需要的善良生命，不会是一个生活的旁观者或议论者，而是一个具足识见和信念的实干家。May all human beings understand that they have to continuously rely on external resources and support for survival. And that they should gratefully and humbly give love and care to all the good and sincere beings who are in need. Let him or her not act like a bastard or critics of life, but a learned and faithful person putting steadfastly the false belief in practice. 祝愿所有人都明白到，只有人类形态生命才具有发展事物和创造事物的功能。亦只有人类才具有分辨是非是恶和传播知识的功能。希望所有人都能够善用这些特殊功能去升华自己的人格。更希望所有人多些利用笑声，给他人带来欢乐。在所有动物世界中，只有人类才懂得笑。May all human beings understand that only in human forms their lives are capable of innovating, creating, and developing. Only human beings are capable of telling right from wrong, the good from the bad, and spreading and propagating knowledge. May all people use such special qualities wisely to improve the human character. We wish people through their smiles bring joy to others, as human beings are the only living kind able to smile. 祝愿所有人都觉悟一切事物在时光旅程中都是不停地变幻无常。依缘起特性而善，依俗世空间的事物，终极真相都只是无我性的缘起幻象。故此，在遇到任何顺逆环境中，冲击时都能够觉悟到，这就是世情的无常无我真理，并有能力与冷静的态度、无畏的勇气去接受真相和保持心灵安稳度过。May all human beings realize that everything in this world is going through the journey that encounters impermanences and consistent change. Any existence that originates from causative conditions is ultimately or truly no more than a selfless from that change continuously as the underlying conditions evolve over time. Thus, under any favorable or unfavorable circumstances, one should realize the impermanence and the selfness. Principles are the reality of this world, and remain calm, tranquil, and courageous in facing any challenge. 祝愿所有人都明白自己生命本体就是神。过去哲学、宗教家们描述的神，只是大自然法则、物理、化学幻变的功能现象。任何个体生命活动都是自然法则、神的本体能量试验。根据主观推理去宣扬有神或无神观点，都是不完整的极端说法。人类唯有收集、开启潜藏的正观智慧，才可窥探到宇宙的实相，懂得运用中观的毅力去解脱生老病死、轮回束缚的苦恼。May all human beings understand that what past religious philosophers had described as God. Is actually the functional properties of the law of nature, 
with this accompanying changing physical and chemical phenomenon. And such functional properties reside as well in a human body. The activities of individual lives are, no, are nothing but the manifested energy of such natural phenomenon, or God's act, obligating either this、um, existence or the non-existence of God on the basis of subjective deduction, is always incomplete and extreme. Human beings can only, by deep cultivation, Activate the uncovered or latent inward wisdom to see the truth of the universe. Possessing and deploying the balanced, non-extremist inward wisdom, one can get rid of the care and bondage associated with the constant flow of birth, aging, sickness, and death. 祝愿所有人每天都有机缘收集心灵拓展和吸纳到新的知识。乐于向他人的优点学习，懂得跟自己交朋友，具有艺术眼光去欣赏宇宙万物，认识到不同文化的优点和缺点，无惧地演好在人生舞台上扮演不同的角色。到了生命终点时，仍可莞然一笑地融汇在大自然祖先长河安宁的怀抱中，不受后有。May all human beings be fortunate enough every day. To have the opportunity in right conditions to cultivate and grow spiritually with new knowledge, and enjoy learning from other people's dreams, to be friend with oneself and appreciate the universe and all matters through the perspective of ours, come to know both the good and bad side of cultures, and each play in every rose that one belongs on the grand stage of life to the best of one's effort. By the time the last moment or thought of one's life has arrived, carrying a little smile, one can return to the warmth and peaceful embrace of Mother Nature permanently, and live forever the cycle of birth and rebirth. <laughs>